How to install Android S or Android 12 Developer Preview 1 by OOF Gang on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And guess what? We have an awesome port of Android S or Android 12 Developer Preview 1 available for the Xiaomi Poco F1 and this is different from the video which I made the other day this port is by OOF gang and we are going to install that port in this video so as you can see I do have my Poco F1 which is running MIUI 12 based on Android 10 now what are the prerequisites for this video unlocked bootloader then you need to have a custom recovery installed do note we are going to change the recovery to TWRP by OOF gang and then something which is very important is you need your device to be decrypted so if I go into settings password and security and privacy you can see encryption and credentials says phone not encrypted now in case you are on a custom ROM which is based on AOSP how do you find out whether your device is encrypted or not well you can go into settings and then if you go into security tap on advanced here it is you can see this device over here is encrypted so for you to install android s or android 12 developer preview 1 on your poco f1 your device needs to be decrypted and videos for all the prerequisites can be found in the description of this video next thing make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent also make sure you have a backup of all your pictures, videos, anything important which you have on your device because if you run into any boot loops, any issues, we might have to perform a format data from TWRP in which case you are going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. Next up, what are the files which you need? All the files which you need are linked in the description of this video. So for starters, you need the system file for Android 12, then you need the vendor file, then you also need the latest firmware for the POCO F1 and of course you need the image file which is TWRP recovery by OOF gang. Next thing you need to do is you will go into settings and then you will go into password and security remove your screen lock fingerprint and face unlock. Once that is done go back go into me account and remove your me account. Once that is done go back go into accounts and sync and remove your google account those of you who are on custom roms based on aosp you won't have the option of removing your me account next thing once you've removed all the accounts and security measures make sure you reboot your device once we are doing this to ensure that all the accounts and security measures have been removed successfully now before you ask me why are we removing all these accounts and security measures we're doing this because we're switching roms and i don't want you to be locked out of your own device next thing we need to do is boot into our current custom recovery so for that first up turn off your device and once the device has turned off we need to press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till we see the custom recovery boot logo and if you get a message about keeping system read only swipe to allow modifications now as you can see right now i am running the latest twrp for poco f1 which is 3.5.1 but we need to use the twrp by oof gang so how do you do that well you go into install select install image and now you navigate to the folder where you have downloaded the twrp file now in case you downloaded the file on your phone directly it will be in the download folder if you transfer it manually you would know where it is so i will go into the download folder select this file twrp by oof gang and on the next screen select recovery and then swipe to confirm flash once that is done tap on the home button go into reboot and select recovery if you get a message about no os installed ignore it swipe to reboot and bam there it is as you can see we are now running twrp recovery by oof gang and before you ask me can this process be done without using this specific recovery the answer to that is no next thing we need to do is we will go into wipe advanced wipe dalvik cache system vendor and data and then swipe to wipe once that is done we will tap on the home button go into 
install now again you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files and if you downloaded the files on your phone directly they will be in the download folder the first file which we need to select is the firmware file then add more zips select the system file for android 12 add more zips and then select the vendor file for android 12 and then swipe to confirm flash now once all the files have flashed successfully make sure there were no errors so we can scroll up a little and here it is we are flashing the firmware file and there were no errors in flashing the firmware file next up we are flashing the system file and no errors in the system file either similarly we are flashing the vendor file and no errors in flashing the vendor file either then tap on the home button and go into reboot and select system now in case you run into any boot loops or any issues then you will have to boot back into twrp by pressing and holding volume up and power button at the same time while you are in the boot loop you will go into wipe format data type in yes and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right as i mentioned earlier in this video format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device so make sure you have a backup of all those things for now we will skip the format data going to reboot and select system and if it asks you to install twrp app i just uncheck it and say do not install and bam there it is we do have the google boot animation on our poco f1 which means our device is booting into android s or android 12 developer preview one and the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and there it is android developer preview in the building tap on ok and now let me skip the initial setup real quick and as you can see we do have the option of choosing between a light theme and a dark theme on the setup let us choose light for now because it is easier to record videos with a light theme next up let us go into settings and for starters let us go into security and as you can see encryption and credentials says phone not encrypted which means we did not have to flash disable force encryption explicitly next up we can go back go into about phone bam pixel 5 in the building tap on it and now if i go into the android version here it is android version is s security patches from march 2021 the kernel they are using is Genos kernel by OOF gang and there it is peeps we have successfully installed Android S or Android 12 developer preview one on the Poco F1 and as you can see G apps are baked in you have Chrome you have photos you have recorder we can also go into settings and here is the UI so they haven't enabled the new monet ui on this build and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you